Another Fusion quick tip. Right here I'm showing a part. This is not very big. This is a lug nut cap that I printed, 3D printed for my uh, travel trailer. And it has a hex gun hole in it. But this, this tip is about saving objects, components, parts, whatever you want to call them. And when you save something, let me, uh, let me just do something here. I'll open up, I'll open a sketch up. So there's a change in my drawing. There we go. Stop sketch. Now it thinks I changed something. And when you save something, you hit save and you get this little box. Add version description. It's a very good idea to put a description in. And I'm going to show you why. Okay. And I'm going to say okay. Now it saved that version of what, where I'm at right now. And down here, you'll see on the thumbnail, it's doing this little save thing. But down here, you'll see these version numbers on your drawings. Like this one says version 14. Well, if you click on that, oops, click on that, what opens up is another window. Trailer, lug nut cover, who made it, when was it last updated, and all that information. But down here, you'll see a listing. And, and if you hit show all, you can see all the versions you saved every time you saved it. And by putting a note in there or a description to your version save, like right here on version 9, adjust it inside dimension. You can, you'll know what you did and have a history of your versions. But the other nice thing about this is that let's say down here version version uh, 3 or version 7 let's say version 7 version 7 was where i didn't make a mistake or is where i want to really work on is in that in that area uh, of my editing you can promote that to the very top of the list and make it the most current version by clicking on this little arrow right here you can say promote now, version 7 is going to become version 15 be at the top of the list. It's actually version 7. And, and now it's right here as the picture. And you'll see here I had version 14 open. So I'm going to close version 14 and double click here. And it's going to be 15. But we promoted version 7. So actually it's the version 7 is that uh, we're going to be able to work on. So you can always, what I'm getting at here is that you can always go back to a previous save and work on it from that point forward. See, version 7, well, it looks the same as the other version. So, But, but, but that's, that's the point of this, so that these little version numbers will show you your history. And if you don't have any notes, you don't know what you did. So it's always best to write something. I'm really bad about writing things, but it's... It's very helpful and useful. And you get you other, other options here used in drawings. Like these parts aren't used in anything else. So, But you, you have a lot of options to explore there. A little toy I made. So it's just a very helpful thing. Be sure to put a description in and uh, track your changes. And you can always go back to those changes. Thanks, you guys, for watching. Please subscribe. If you have any helpful tips that you want to pass on, uh, let me know. Uh, put it in the comments. Send me an email. And we'll see about getting something shot and uh, end up for you guys. So, so thank you for watching. Please subscribe. Please comment, share. Thumbs up, thumbs down, all that good stuff. And click that notification bell for more tips. We'll catch you in the next one.